Uh, I will talk about sexual harassment a little bit. I was sexually harassed. I'm actually sexually harassed most days, actually, but <laughs> it doesn't bother me. It doesn't bother me. I know some of you guys are like, why does that not bother? It doesn't bother me, because honestly, it's just, it, it's, it's a compliment to me, honestly. It just lets me know I still got it. Um, yeah, if I go to work and someone doesn't slap me on my butt, I think I'm slipping. It might be time <laughs> to go do some squats, squeeze, squeeze, tighten it up. I like, I like hearing that I look good. Call me crazy. But you know, people try and uh, act like being sexually harassed is not a compliment. It is a compliment. You know how we know this? Because everybody in here knows somebody that has tried to convince them they've been sexually harassed and you didn't believe them because they were not cute. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> really? You, Helen? They, he did, really? <laughs> Are you sure? <laughs> Mean but true. Next time you get sexually harassed, just say thank you. Um, gold diggers. We have any gold diggers in the house? Yes, I. I could tell when she walked through the door. Um, but yeah, no gold. I don't like gold diggers. I don't like that. I don't like that women will just use men like that. Cause there, you know, there are some women that will actually find like professional football players and famous people and they will go out and get knocked up by these guys just so they can get child support for the rest of their lives. Which, you know, I don't think is right because it gives women like me who just want a few bills paid off a bad name. <laughs> I'm not trying to have anybody's baby. <laughs> okay, I'm not. I can't, not right mess all this up. How am I supposed to get sexually harassed with this all stretched out and stuff? It's not gonna work. It's not gonna work. But if, if I, honestly, if I did have a famous person's baby, I wouldn't even ask them to raise the child and give me child support. I wouldn't care. You know, if, if that were to happen to me, I would just have the baby and make sure that they autographed it. <laughs> you know how much money you can get for an autographed, authentic Reggie Bush baby? <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm gonna leave on this last note. I'm gonna leave on a nice, Pleasant note. Um, what's worse than uh, finding out that your mom gave you up for adoption? What? Finding out that she really wanted to abort you, but she missed the deadline. <laughs> I, oh, I knew I shouldn't have gone to Vegas. <laughs> now I'm out $400 and I still have the baby. Oh, that sucks. <laughs> All right, guys, that's my time. Have a good night.